show you in five minutes or less, and then in three minutes or less, it's going to draw you a picture, uh, and that will get you started when you have follow-up questions or you want to know how to do more, post them to our forums at marginallyclever.com slash forums, oh, and, uh, and we will happily make follow-up videos, and, and you'll meet all the other people who have Michelangelo's, because there's thousands now around the world, and, um, and learn more about making robots. Especially if you're a teacher, we have a new forum for teachers to share notes and stories and be awesome. Yes? Let's all double down because education budgets are so tight these days. Thank you. Now let's get on with the show. Let's open this box. So it finally arrived. My marginally clever robot. In this box we'll find the counterweights, the belts, and the hooks. Some protective padding. The pen holder and four suction cups. North American power supply. A little back and forth action here. We'll get the suction cup in no trouble. Make sure to have that little tab on the outside where you can reach it when it's on the window. Now we put together the SD card and it slots in on the left. go putting out the robot in with the power the hooks should look like you should see the belt behind the hook on both sides we're gonna make sure that happens so you can't put the left belt on the right pulley that would be that would not the drawing might come out a little bit not square we don't want that so the one on the left here is correct. The one on the right is not correct. Note the colors when these are put together. Match the colors correctly. The tape holds the pen in the pen holder. Your pen size may vary. Now we're opening the download from marginallyclever.com starting the Michelangelo software. This is version 7.9. Because the robot has power and is plugged in, it can be found perfect. Now let's go to the download folder and there's a calibration file inside that. Here it is. This is included with the software download. This step is optional. Cool. We're ready to draw. Now actually we're going to home it first. This Michelangelo 5 has a new feature. It can home itself. So the weights will go up until it touches the switches. And as long as you put the belts on the correct side, we've already fine tuned it so it will go to the home position on its own. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. We're ready to go. Now I'm pushing the border button, which drives it around the edge of the paper where the paper will go. So you can put a pen in here and draw directly on the glass to always know. Or you can put the paper in, draw, go around the border, adjust the paper, repeat until you're happy. We'd love to see your creations. So bring them to marginallyclever.com, post them in our forums, and meet other people who are doing cool things. Learn about robots. Uh, meet people educating. All kinds of opportunities. Now I'm going to put in that paper I talked about. This is actually the back of a pad of a hundred sheets of paper because I draw a lot of things with the robot.
to why I feel the urge to speak like this when I'm in front of the camera. I had some kind of swoon. All right, world, now that I've got you in a death grip, listen closely. 